All right, so new day, new guild war. <clears throat> we'll see what our ranking is this time. So we're at 213, we won the last one, uh, despite uh, my raging. So hopefully this doesn't happen again this time. Um, this one seems fairly straightforward. Um, probably gonna attack this fort here. I'm actually attacking earlier than I usually do, which is why uh, these forts are still up. Uh, so this first tower, Hmm. I feel like running something like this here. Where is... There she is. Uh, the fastest person on this team is going to be Kron at 175. Is what my team is saying anyway. He's got Elia's knife, so basically he's going to hit somebody. <clears throat> Chances are it's going to be... Well, it's going to be one of these two. It's not going to be her. Um, yeah, this K-Ron is making it kind of difficult to go with this. Um, I might have to go with something else. Maybe... Something like this. With this, right? Because he can go... Then push everybody forward. She'll AOE. Uh, give her skill nullifier. She'll have three stacks. She can S3 her. Uh, and then he'll want to S3 her, but she'll have... Yeah, so she, didn't, she shouldn't have enough stacks to wipe off... She shouldn't have enough stacks at the end of this to wipe off all our... Um, uh, skill nullifiers. And then she should be able to just hit her. The problem being... Um, Ruel here is going to revive somebody. It's going to revive her because she might die. Well, she's on 16k HP. Uh, this this top team is a little interesting. Um, honestly, I might just... Let's go see. I might just, like, mirror them. Do Let's see, do this here. Uh, I want the one up here. Well, if we throw in all water, it makes it so that K-Ron attacks someone randomly, which is like, you kind of don't want that, but... I think this is pretty good. I re-geared my Lilibet. So hopefully she can do something a little more than not at all. Um, so down here, 210 speed on Lily on um, FCC, 16k HP on Charles. Um, so I think this is I think this is what I'm gonna do here. Yeah, because she can S3 Charles. Hopefully, I mean even if it doesn't die, maybe the stun will help. Um, yeah, and the, uh, FCC is going to hit him and she's going to hit her, which means she's basically safe. Like he'll S3 and hopefully she doesn't die from that. Um, but I think that's good. Uh, yeah, let's, let's just get in there see how this one turns out. Okay, so yeah, he's like 170 something. Uh, let's just give you immunity. So sometimes if you see me use um, her on some comps, I'll use immunity right away just because like there's a Basar on their team or something like that. Uh, let's hit you because I want to put as much damage into SSB as possible. Okay, good. So he went after he went after the one person I wanted him to go after. Like out of all three, it's pretty lucky on my end that he went after. Um, this guy here, 16k HP. She didn't have a lot of defense because she took a lot of damage from that uh, S2. She also hits, she doesn't hit very hard either. Let's see what this does. My Rengar's at 95%. I just need to go through Raid and pick up the um, Charm and I'll have uh, maxed out Rengar's. So that's cool. <clears throat> Okay, 
I think it, it's really funny because SSB does counter um, K-Ron pretty hard, I'd say. Because, uh, like, you will sometimes uh, S3 him, get the unbuffable, and not kill him. Because if you if the S3 kills him, brings him down to 0 HP or 1 HP or whatever to kill him, the, un the unbuffable comes on after he gets the immortality. But if you get the unbuffable and you don't kill him, and something happens like SSB there... Um, the only reason it didn't work this time because it's got the unhealable and not the unbuffable. So, um, normally what happens is, uh, let's do this. Normally what happens is the, um, unbuffable gets on and then she S2s afterwards and that's enough to kill him and he just dies. It's like, it's pretty incredible how, uh, how well he tends to, she tends to counter him. Not to mention the fact that like, even if, even if that combo doesn't go off, uh, well, that's a pretty decent amount of damage. Even if that combo doesn't go off, um, let's see. You, uh, his AOE S ones generally tend to like be enough to do serious work. So she's gonna heal her. I think I'm just gonna S three. Uh, should I just S three her? I didn't see how much HP that Ruel had. Just gonna S3 her. Uh, the reason I'm going with her instead of ooh, I didn't actually kill him. Um, is because like that way I can get damage on both sides. Oh man, he's got the defense break. He might die. Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, I was worried uh, that Kron if he crits. Well, if he, if he gets, if he lands the hit, because the first time he missed and it didn't do any damage, and the second time he actually hit and it did quite a decent amount of damage. Um, with that defense break, if that K-Ron were to hit, I think he might have just killed uh, Krow, which would have sucked, but it is what it is. I, don't, I wonder how much resistance this, uh, this Ruel has. Because my SSB has like 50 effectiveness, so she might have like 50 something. I don't know if she has 100. I don't know. Alright, so here's, yeah, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna boost them forward. Let's, uh... Okay, so this is where I want to... I'm gonna S... Oh, I can't do that either. Uh, That kind of sucks. Uh, ruined. Hmm. She's got 27k HP, usually when they go slightly lower on the HP. Well, I mean, it's about the same as mine. Mine's like 29 with SSB. Um, but she's pretty fast. Usually they try to, like, people try to build um, decently damaged Dili. Um, FCC is like a lot of crit damage. Let's see what this gets me. Okay, so I got a counter here. Okay, so she's gonna do the same thing. Uh, which is gonna suck because. Uh, so this is bad. I shouldn't do this, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Let's just do this. Okay, so I got the double Elber. So there's one. Okay, cool. <clears throat> um. So with the maxed Elbrus, 20% chance on on these two, right? If I hit him, it's a 20% chance guarantee because he's on counter set. But like, again, it comes down to like, is the, the gamble is, does he have a not maxed Elbrus? Which I don't think he does. This, this Charles isn't hitting very hard. Obviously he doesn't have the attack buff either though, so that's something to consider. Oh, I forgot she had um. I thought she had an AoE there. I was like, oh, she's just gonna focus her. Oh, this might kill my uh, Euphine. I think she's dead. <sighs> she died. Um, so yeah, I, I lost to the greater attack buff Alexa's proc on her AoE, which that's kind of dumb. Um, Yeah, I guess there's really no reason to keep going here. Let's just get out of here. Oh, 
so they took this one down. Uh, basically, we're just waiting for them to take that down. But I think, let's see, how, how are we doing here? This is 80, so I think if this person do takes the W, then uh, we'll be fine. So I'm just going to hit this tower over here, just because why not? Um, let's do this. It's weird they didn't go for this one. This one looks pretty easy. Uh, let's do... Where is my... There she is. Let's go with you here. Uh, I don't have the soul burn, which is gonna suck, but it, you know... That might give me the soul burn. S3 into S3 into S1. Uh, but after she failed me last time, I'm kind of over it. So I'm just, I think I'm just gonna go with like something like this. Uh, where is my Tenebria? Um, the biggest problem is that uh where's Ruel? This arbiter is like gonna hit me and I'm gonna die. I don't know what the speeds are on this. Uh this up here looks decent. Um da -da -da. Yeah, I'm not sure what else I can put up there. Maybe like put Charles for attack buff, uh, but I think what I have up there is fine. Yeah, so let's go with this, see how this goes. You've made it this far. No what she got like 200 speed, something like that? Let's make sure we get the immunity up on you. Uh, so usually you want to target the SSB because SSB doesn't have high defense. Um, well, usually they don't have high defense, right? They have more HP, um, which means that the lower defense she has, the more damage she's going to take, which means she's going to transfer more damage. So irrelevant of how much HP she has, she's just going to transfer a lot more damage in that case. Okay, so I didn't get the defense break on myself, so that's pretty cool. Um, Ruel's gonna revive somebody right now. If they die. Okay, no one died, never mind. Well, she's still gonna use the S3. I really think that maybe she should be using, like, the AI should switch to using the S2 first. Like, have the same, whatever, um... It goes on with their AI to dictate when um, certain uh, actions are taken. Leave that the way it is, but change one of them to be uh, just make it so the S2 should go before the S3. Just because, like, that's what you always want to bait out. You want to bait out the S3 before the S2 anyway. Because um, now, like, I can do this. I can kill her and she won't come back, right? So now she can only heal herself and the other one. So the fact that like she 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 loses the revive so early on is what I'm sort of think should be changed there. Um, let's just hit you and up. I think in this case, I'm just going to keep uh, hitting Ruel because this uh, uh, Alencia, this Lilius won't do anything to me. And she's just going to feed me stacks constantly. Well, maybe not if I just kill her with this, yeah. Um, in that case, I, like even the Idol's Cheer is going to be boosting up uh, Lilius, but I think that's fine because that way she just like dual attacks and keeps feeding me uh, SSB stacks, which makes it so you can kill both of them faster. Bring it 
Uh, it doesn't really matter whether I cleanse this off or not. 27, 25. Well, she's been landing those. Let's just hit you with this. Hit you with this. See if this kills her. Oh, it didn't kill her, but it slept her. Mm, there. What's going on here? Um. Okay, so he went first, which is kind of interesting. Um. Come on, please counter. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see if she stuns anybody. I just didn't some shit. <clears throat> okay, so she missed on. He missed. Or did he miss? Oh, he didn't miss, but he didn't crit. Uh, so at this point, I'm just gonna do uh, this one. That's good, yeah. <clears throat> so they took their whole turn, which means that they're going to be slowed, and I can, I think I can lap them fast enough to get the uh, S2 off. Okay, he didn't counter, which is kind of weird. Hit him with this. See if he counters this one. If he counters this one, it doesn't really matter, considering um, this is actually a good combo, right? Because then I S2, and I extend the uh, all these buffs here. I think I'm just going to hit you, because I don't want to wake up the other ones. Let's do this. So, uh, Vildred's gonna come back. I think he's gonna kill um, Dizzy, but that's fine. Did he? Uh, see, I, I wasn't paying attention. I was looking somewhere else when he the first time he has three. So, uh, did he get the greater attack the first time? He might have. I'm not entirely sure though. Um, so this is kind of a pickle here because he might just die from this. Yeah, from that counter attack. Oh, the S1 didn't kill me, but uh, unfortunately he got he hit the S2 proc there, and she's gonna die. Uh, let's do... Let's do... Let's do you. Uh, let's see if she can survive. I, I, I doubt she can. Uh, there's a lot of damage coming our way here. So there's one. Okay. Okay, good. Basically, I just needed her to get here. Miss. Okay. See if I can sleep him. Actually, I should be focusing on, um, what's his name over there? Let's just do this. I should be really focusing on, uh, Vildred, because, again, I, I said this last time, but, like, <sighs> then you get the, um, Alexis. <sighs> Why do I even bother? Actually, doing decent damage. Let's just see... Because his uh, revive sneaks up on you sometimes. I was gonna do major damage. I don't die. <sighs> there you go. Uh, so yeah, I lost to an S1. Well, basically I lost to Alexis there. Um, I guess at this point... I don't feel like waiting to attack the stronghold. Uh, so let's just go find something else. I gotta go do arena uh, RTA right now too because uh, season's closing and I really want to see about getting into challenger. Let's just pick any because at this point it's like it doesn't really matter. Um, we're going with uh, grass here. So let's do you, you, and uh, and you. Why not? 
So, we'll see how that goes. Um, there's no one to revive, but I don't really have, like, well, let's just do you. Yeah. Uh, my Biken is a little tankier, just because that's what the gear I had on her. I want to see how this works, though. She's got, like, a, an HP boot for some reason. Um, up here, let's do, let's just keep that. Uh, I think I'm just going to keep with this here. Uh, the, the main problem is going to be if he has, where is, uh, there you are. The main problem is going to be if he has, uh, her on Ayelas, but, uh, that should be fine, I think. Uh, I think I'm going to focus her with, the uh, Crow S3 anyway. Uh, yeah, we'll see how this goes. It'll go pretty well, I think. Uh, let's see. so let's get the defense buff up to course let's hit you with this see if I get the pushback I did and we'll get this it's funny because she also counters Alexa's too right because like if you get the unbuffable on them and it becomes his turn and he gets the Alexis proc he won't actually get it but lucky me I got the um, portrait of the saviors variety there uh, so here he comes again he didn't do that much damage on the first time. Um, I doubt he's going to do that much damage this time either. Yeah. Uh, defense buff is a hell of a drug. Uh, so this will probably kill... Uh, yeah, this is going to kill uh, Dizzy here, which is pretty cool. Uh, so next, let's just kill him. And then lastly, we'll just kill him. I didn't kill him, obviously, but um, we'll be fine. Twenty-seven k. Yeah, people are building their um, purgases for uh, wyvern, and you just kind of like put him into your guild war team sometimes. Um, I think he'd be pretty good. I have to like like G Perg. Uh, what's her name? Uh, Ruel with like. Um, What's that uh, card? Uh, let's not use this yet. Uh, let's hit. No, let's just hit you. There we go. Nice. Um, Ruel, G Perg, and like, uh, what's her name? S Tenny. Sounds like a really good idea. Just because it's like, you can have like, um, Ayala's. No, not Ayala's. What's that other one? Uh, so let's just do. You here. Wow, that's a lot of bleeds. I think she should die if I get a turn here. It's actually pretty great considering the fact that like she landed the both of the debuffs on uh, both green on two green units. Um, fantastic. Uh, so let's do. Um. Let's just do this. Uh, if anything, I think um, Krau is going to S3, what's her name? Uh, uh, Viking, which is fine. Wow, what the... I didn't get to see that. Uh, that was weird. Um, I don't know what to do here. Uh, should I just S3 him? S1 him. Three K. That's not bad. Uh, yeah, I think she's gonna. He's just gonna kill Biken, which is all right. Yeah, because it means that um, Charles is still here. Okay, and we'll just stomp him out. Ooh, and he didn't die. That's a, that's a uh, missing 20% damage molas on her. I just need like one baby mouth insignia and she'll be fine. Um, so that was that. Two draws and a victory at the end there. Um, yeah, that's good for today. We'll, uh, you'll see next time. Uh, the title is going to be weird because you know, I don't know what that means and I don't know how to put that in words. Um, so bet you can just like copy paste this right here, huh? Um, but yeah, so lots of some interesting RNG here. Uh, also, oh no, not here. Where was it? 
somewhere. I think the first one. Was it the first one? Yeah, I guess it was the first one, probably. Um, but yeah, anyway, that's that. Uh, I'll probably have a video later for uh, RTA and all that. So, yep, that's it for today.